Greetings, everybody. This is Harmony speaking. I'm a QHHT quantum healing hypnosis therapy practitioner. Unfortunately, that can only be done in person. However, before I became a QHHT practitioner, I invented the soul harmonics technique specifically to be done remotely. So that's always been done remotely. Majority, <laughs> it's only been a couple times I did it in person. So anyway, what you're about to hear is I got permission from my client to play uh, the audio excerpt. It's going to be about 15 minutes. Um, basically, what you're about to hear, it's going to really sound like just two people talking. It, it really does. But in reality, this is at the about an hour and a half into the session, and the client's higher self is still speaking, but we're still we're essentially done with the session. So the format changes to it's where it's a very loose conversation because we're done doing all the healing and all the work and everything. And um, so the higher self asked uh, me a question. Uh, you know, during the session, we're getting rid of some, you know, boo -boo -boo -boo, you know, bad guy kind of stuff. And the higher self commanded it to be gone, got rid of it. And according to universal law, it should have been gone. But this is not my first rodeo. And I said, wait a second, higher self. Um, they're actually hiding. And, and, you know, we did some work. And anyway, we cleared the, the, the whole thing up. And the higher self asked the question, how could these beings in this reality violate universal law? Because I commanded them to be gone, and they should, according to universal law, they should have been gone. So the client asked me this, or the higher self asked me this question, and now you're about to hear the recording where I'm giving that explanation, and what happens next is quite fascinating. So I hope you uh, enjoy. Okay. Oh, they always do crap. It's called the universal law of uh, they 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 ask permission, and you know by saying hey you're my sister if you say yes, then they say oh okay you agree therefore now you're my sister now I can hang out. According oh my to, gosh. Accor according to universal law, you just gave me permission to hang out, and there's nothing yes. to do about it. And they stick their tongue out at you and go nanny nanny billy go. You know. Uh huh. I call it the universal handbook of lies by permission or something like that. <laughs> they, have a, they have a handbook. It's like how to get from, okay, here, let me give you an example. I'll, I guess I'll teach the higher self. Um, let's say a, a, a demon or a monster comes in the living room yeah. and, you, and you go, oh, you're scary. You know, the human does, not you. Not you yeah. The human goes, oh, you're scary. And then the, the, the being says, you're right, I'm scary. You just gave me permission to be I'm scary. Be scary. And to be here. So now I'm going to be here and scare you. <laughs> okay. Now the, hu the human goes, That's not, that doesn't make any sense. That's not fair. I didn't give her permission. All I did is say, you're scary. But see, the human doesn't have the, the rule book. Because there's this whole manual and there's this rule book. And according to the rule book, you did give permission. And we don't know the rules. That's the problem. But do you know what we can do? What? They destroy can, their handbook. Yes, we can burn the handbook. And I say, I, I, you know what I did? I say, I say, I say out loud that I, I now, as my higher self, enact a new universal law that you may not use that universal law any longer. No, no, no we have to burn it. Ha, okay, you do it. You take oh, the floor. Go for it. I do it. Okay, I will burn all that handbook crap forever. Hey, yeah, you see my higher self joining you? Yes. I see a lot of higher selves. All right, well, do you see a whole bunch of higher selves burning that manual? Yes. Let's burn that, baby. That is no longer allowed no. in this reality no. ever again. It's no. cheating. You are not allowed to cheat. Yes. You're, by doing that, you have always, always violated universal law. Yes. Your little manual was not a permission slip. We did not grant you that permission. You cheated and you lied, and now it's gone. <laughs> yeah. It shall be no more. No, never. <laughs> gone. Trent, you can't use that. Oh, do you hear them? Listen, did you hear that? Yes, I hear them. Answer them for me. They're, they're beating me up. I'm human right now. I'm getting beat up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hey, hey oh. higher self, your higher self, can you beat these guys up for me? No, I'm not. I'm not a beater. Oh, sorry. Did, okay, did, did, anyway. can, no, we okay. can just ban them out of the ring. Okay, they have to just leave. 
Yeah, yeah. get them out, get them out it, of here. It doesn't matter because I would just, they just have to leave. That's it. They are no more longer here. They don't exist anymore. So there you go. That okay. makes them mad. But um, I have compassion okay. for them, but they can still, I mean, they cannot do that. And it's also not good for them because they are not creating anything good for them. So here, put it this way, by banning your book, what we have enabled you to do is we created a space of reality where you can change your ways and join us in this thing we call the shift, this ascension you see. Yes. You are worried that you're going to be left behind and that's why you're scared and that's yes. why you're holding on to this reality and you're holding to everything you can possibly hold on to. You know that we just took your anchor away. Your anchor to this reality, this moment, this day has now been removed. You have yes. no anchor in this reality. You're free, free floating around. So why don't you get on board and join us? We've only invited you mm -hmm. for thousands and millions and I don't know how many, how long <laughs> we've been inviting you to come with us. <laughs> Just give up this bullshit. Oh. Give up this reality. Let go of it. We got a whole lot better place to go to and we're going to have a whole lot more fun. And, you know, like everybody's invited. You just got to come along. Join the party. Okay. You know? They say three, two, one, zero. They're debating right now. Yeah, well, they can go debate. <laughs> Let's send them to the debating room. And we're and done. We're goodbye. Just, goodbye. Yes. I, I, I am <laughs> now, I am now closing the door. The energy is now sealed. The door yeah. is shut. It's slammed. I'm pushing you all away. <laughs> goodbye. Goodbye. Go somewhere and have your debates and your oh. high council meetings and. <laughs> You all go fight over there. So go over there and fight over there. Oh, Goodbye. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're a little upset, but that's okay. <laughs> that's all right. Oh my gosh, I see a lot of people in that room, actually, to be honest with you. <laughs> that's, oh, hundreds, yeah. A lot of people that and I it, know. Yeah. Oh my gosh. In what room? That's good. In that room where we just stand, everybody. Oh, there. Oh, yeah. Forget them. I don't want. I don't want to forget them. Yeah. Well, if you know them, if you know them, hopefully they'll talk with some sense into them. No, no, no. It's fine because they know what they do, and they now they are very aware, and now they can discuss their bullshit, and we just move on, and that's it. All right. All right. Let's move on. Because All right. I don't have time for uh, any of that shit anymore. <laughs> no, I don't have time for it either. I, 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 the human being dealt with it for 20 years, 20 years. He, cool. he, Byron, the biological unit dealt with them for 20 oh. years. For 20 yeah. years, I lectured them, taught them, explained things to <sighs> them, told them how it's going to be. I, I've sat on their high council meetings, the whole nine yards. I did it all. And then one day I said, I give up. I'm retired. Goodbye. Yeah. I'm retired from that organization. You know, I threw my hat on the hook and goodbye. I'm retired. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm done. Yeah, and, you know, it's we, we don't have much time left anyway. So they, they got to make up their minds pretty quick here anyway. So. Oh, they have to. Yeah. They, they have to do what they have to do. And whatever it is for them, it's their thingy. It's not ours anymore, so phew, phew, out. <laughs> out of the way. Oh my gosh, shit. <sighs> okay, that was very good. Now we are free of that. And there are new things coming right now. I see it very, very quickly moving down. So you see what moving? New things, new, new energies. Thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's mm -hmm. just flowing right now. Because oh, can you check on Mother Earth, uh, Gaia, they call it? Can you check on her? She's already integrated in me. Oh, well, can, how is she doing? Does she need help or anything or, you know? No, she's in my stomach. Oh, area. okay. She's in my stomach area. Okay. And well, mm -hmm. I don't know if you see something. I don't know. Um, what I meant is go down to the dirt beneath our feet. The biological unit is sitting on earth right now and there's dirt beneath our feet. So can you go down into the dirt? Is there a consciousness down there? What's going on beneath the feet? Mm. Dirt. What's going on in the dirt below us? <laughs> is there a consciousness down there? I know there's a bunch of, ignore the aliens. I don't care about the aliens and the humans and the underground bases. I'm not 
I'm not talking about that. <laughs> I'm talking about energy beings. Is there is there any um, eighth dimensional beings hurting the earth or any? Is there anything bugging the earth? You know, down there because there was. No, it seems only like like the the things we already know. That's what I feel like. Yeah. But let well, me. Well, I'll, 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 no, don't say that long. Okay, no. what we can do. I will go inside and we can both start spiraling. No, I, I'm already there. I'm in the center now. If you feel like it, so we will spiral things and it will just speed up stuff to come to the surface. That's all I see. But it's just like little spirals, like little hurricanes or whatever. How about the, the, the trees connecting to the atmosphere? How's that doing? The trees are doing good. The trees, any, what did the, can you talk to the trees connect? Can you uh, like drift and flow and connect to the trees, the tree consciousness? And, and yes. Mm -hmm. What do the trees want us to do? They're flying, it seems. Oh, they're having fun. So they're good. So everything's good. All right. They're flying and everything is like light and fancy. I don't know. It feels good. Yeah. All right. So everything's fine then. Okay, good. That is oh, fine, yeah. yeah. But they say the roots, the roots, something is, the roots have to do something. It feels like the grow, root, grow, the grow root, deeper. The roots are massaging the earth. Yeah, do the roots need to go deeper? I will go deeper. Uh, there's red, the color red. At the end of the roots, I see red if I go deep. You hear me? Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm focusing ah. on. I'm. I'm extending the energy of the roots deeper and deeper into the earth. I was working. Sorry. Do you see me working? Do you, I'm working on the roots. I'm throwing energy into the roots and getting them connected a higher dimensional. Yeah, um, I see it. It. It looks like little sparkle. Yeah. So I'm trying to get the roots uh, at a higher dimensional level. Energy thrown in there, going into the so they can ex so the energy can extend out. Mm -hmm. As the energy extends out into the dirt, then the the physical thing a root can go into that dimensional opening, and then the, it can grow, and then it can extend. So now the physical can extend, and I'm extending the roots is what I'm doing into the earth. Is, is, do you see that? Uh mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, I need assistance. Do you want assist? Uh mm -hmm. Can you? I'm stuck. <laughs> I got them as far as I can go. I don't know what to do next. Can you talk to Earth? There's a layer. Um, I don't know what that layer is. Subconsciousness. It's hitting this like energy layer. It's it's pretty thick. Um, it's, a I don't, sub, it's a subconscious layer. I don't know what it is. Is this something to be messed with, or should we leave it alone? I don't know. That's but that looks like a major project. <laughs> mm. No, I don't get anything really, but I don't, I only see it's a subconsciousness thing. Oh, well, take, take a look, the barrier's gone now, actually. You, can you see the barrier gone? That subconscious thing you said, we hit, the barrier's gone. They can move, the roots can go past it now. I see inside, it's, like deep inside it's all love but it's like i don't know it's weird it's fun so what is the consciousness of this place call itself does it like that guy any which one that's a conscious everybody calls the consciousness of the earth gaia is it just is that really its name? Does it like that name? <laughs> mm, it's okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry. It's just the spirit, so it's not like the... Mm. The spirit, it, it doesn't really care about the name. Yeah, I got you. We can move on here. I understand. Thank you. It's, All right. It's clearing out now. That's what I get. It, it's totally clearing out. And it's like a crystal energy. 
it's I see like a crystal and it's a crystal energy and it's totally clearing out. That's what it, what I see right now. And it opens up and opens up and opens up and opens up like layer system. That's all I see. And now I see it is forming like a ladder, like stairs, like white stairs going up that comes out of that inner crystal energy, consciousness, whatever it is. And it just says, here you are, you can move on now. So I guess we can all move on. That's it. Okay. It's like, Very good. sets us free and we are free to go. All right. Very good. All right. Shoot. Because Gaia is also just, it was just an expression. It's just, oh, yeah. it's just a word. Yeah. Well, yeah. I heard somebody, I heard somebody say she's really not even a, like a globe. She's like some kind of hexagon pattern or something or. Well, but that's probably the crystal, crystalline energy. Like it has yes. shapes like, a, you know, different physical things or things that we can see in that sense, like hexagons, I don't know, but crystal like mm -hmm. structures. Yeah, same thing, yeah. Yeah, it's the same thing. So that's crystal stuff. Amazing, amazing. I've never seen it from that perspective. So that's great. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> because everybody's always worried about this and that and blah, blah, blah. But I guess it's all, it, we are free. Yeah, we are free now. Free of all of that, free of all the wordings, free of all of that. Mm -hmm. And I can feel it. I mean, I don't know if you feel it. I feel it. I feel it, yeah. It's like all, it's like, it's just there. We just have to move on on the steps and that's it. Mm -hmm. 